Previously on Big Brother Kids. What all the right, hell? Michael. Michael came in the house and shocked all the house guests. Julie, you fooled me here. And Jake and Josh formed an alliance. Michael assured Josh that he was safe, even though his real plan was to backdoor him. My plan this week is to backdoor Josh. At the veto competition, Jake proved that he knew America the best. Nobody talked to me anymore. Who will go home this week? And what shocking, crazy event will stun everyone? Speechless. I can't even believe what just happened. It all happens now on Big Brother Kids. Hello everybody, it's Julie Chen, and welcome to Big Brother Kids. This week was one for the ages. Let's take a look. Congrats on the winning veto. Oh, thanks. This is perfect. It's falling into our plan to backdoor Josh. Are you going to vote him out? Oh, uh, yeah, I guess so. It's, I mean, it's, it's a better asset for me to uh, not have Josh in this game because he is going to probably you know, send me out this game, so I gotta watch out, so you got my vote. Alright. To help myself out, I'm sort of playing both sides of the game. Um, when I went up to Michael and found out that the plan was to backdoor Josh, inside I was pretty pissed because my true loyalty is to Josh, like Ronnie and Big Brother 11, how he was loyal to the athletes, but I'm not, I'm not gonna let that happen. And if I'm not going on the block, then my vote is definitely to keep Josh in this house. When Jake told me about the plan to backdoor me the whole time, I went to Trevor first just to see if this was true. And also, if it was, to see if I could get his vote before going to Michael. Um, eviction's coming up. Yeah, and you know the plan was to evict you. Well, I mean, unless you're offering me something, I won't evict you. I'll keep you safe for the next week. Alright, um, let me just close the door so I'm... Well, okay, I'm offering you all safety, power veto next week. If I win, I'll take you off. Um, HOH, I won't put you up. I started to make offers to Trevor for next week and the weeks ahead because I wanted him to think keeping me here was good for his game. What do you say? Sounds like a deal. I can't guarantee you my vote, but I will vote. Unless something happens, I won't take it. How can I trust you? I can't trust anyone in this house. Well, at least you know, at least you know, it can all be up to, to HOH when, if it goes down to tie. Yeah, but uh, Michael, I don't know. I'm gonna go talk to Michael right now. And yeah, I'm gonna go see what, why he, why, why he wants me out so bad. All right, so can I trust you? I, I don't know. I'm not going to, like, think you are. Unless you do something to hurt me, I'm not going to vote you out. Okay, dude, I swear on my life and on the Lakers, because I love the Lakers, I swear on them that if I get HOH, I will not put you up unless I have to. Because, like, if someone wins a veto, I have to. All right, deal? Deal. All right, peace. Here, let me just... All right, my shot. Okay, thanks for that. I think if Trevor votes to keep me here, that he's really dumb and he will regret this move for the rest of the game. Because what I told him was a bunch of bullshit because you can't trust anyone in this game, especially me. And you better believe if I get HOH next week that I will put him up and I will get him out of the house because he is a big threat. I was really curious because Josh and Trevor were playing pool for a long time and I don't know if Trevor might have changed his vote or he's still voting for me to stay. So a little after I had this discussion with Trevor, I went up to talk to Michael about the whole backdoor plan. And he started telling me things that I knew were lies. And we started having a bunch of screaming matches. And after a while, he actually took a swing and punched me. This was quite a controversial week. 
mostly between Michael and Josh. In fact, when we looked at the tapes, we saw that Michael did intentionally strike Josh, injuring Josh. Although this has happened and Michael has been kicked out of the house, we will not show this footage as it is, as it is inappropriate for all ages. As a result, a new house guest, Jake E., will take over for Michael as America's bully and as a guest in the house for the remainder of the summer. We'll meet Jake E. a little later. You know, when Michael punched Josh, I was sort of shell-shocked. I could have, I've never seen anything like this in Big Brother history. Um, I'm sort of glad to see him go. There was that whole plan of him trying to backdoor Josh, and now the vote relies on me, but I'm going to stick my way and probably vote to keep Josh in this game. He's a good ally to me. Even though Michael is gone, I still think the plan to get out Josh is in effect. I am so glad Michael's gone and out of the house. No more distractions in my head. Now I just gotta focus on getting the votes so I can stay here another week. 